Hey guys, Matt Lowry here, the lead jerk. Hey, just want to go over a quick little presentation here about sales closing ratios with Avatar and telemarketed final expense leads. So I get this question quite often, well, how many am I going to close out of a 25, 50, 100 lead order? Well, it's kind of a loaded question. There's a lot of variables in there to determine the answer to that. But historically, let me give you a, a few um, pointers here that might help you, might help you out. As usual, we're going to keep it simple. Um, number one, how many leads are you ordering? Um, are you working 25 a month or 25 a week? Consistent lead flow is always important. So uh, the more you work a certain type of lead, the more experienced you're going to be in actually working that, whether it's a telemarketed, avatar, or a direct mail lead. So number one, how many leads are you actually working? Number two, which is just as important, what kind of training have you had in final expense? Uh, do you have any training at all? Are you a brand new agent that's just been thrown to the wolves and you have no training whatsoever? You just were provided contracts and they said, go get them, boy. Uh, that doesn't work nowadays. you got to have specialized niche training for final expense. So what I would suggest, if you feel like you're not getting the training you need, um, you know, go to, go to the audio training section of this website. We put that in place to help agents to hear what other agents, top producing agents in the country are doing. Um, there's probably a hundred hours worth of audio there on our audio training page to help you out. So number one, that's what I would do. If, um, if you're feeling like you're lost or a new agent, then um, seek out some training elsewhere. Okay. Number three, what carriers are you carrying in your bag? I mean, who do you, who do you have access to? Um, the more, you can spread yourself as far as writing different uh, health situations, the better off you're going to be. I mean, do you have a guaranteed issue in your bag? Do you have a good graded um, carrier? Do you have a good, uh, you know, preferred level company that's competitive on rates? <clears throat> Are you using a phone interview with your companies? Um, the companies that you do have, do they cover numerous health conditions but still have a competitive rate and offer first day coverage? Those are all things that come into play when you're working any lead, and uh, avatar leads are no different. You need to be able to have all those in your bag and competitively priced to place business. Number four, I'd say, are you? Uh, how are you working a lead? Are you door knocking your avatar telemarketer leads, or are you calling first for an appointment? So usually this falls into one or two categories. Either agents are strictly door knocking the lead, or they're calling for an appointment. So if you're door knocking, you know, you need to have the ability to play the lead, you know, at the door. You need to be able to say, Miss Jones, hey, <clears throat> we called you a few days ago, yada, yada, yada. And here, here's the uh, information you left. And uh, here's, here's the conversation between you and our, and our um, office. And you play it for them, okay? Go in for the sale right then or book an appointment for later. If you're calling for an appointment, uh, some agents only do that. So number five ties in with that. Are you the one actually calling for an appointment or you have an appointment setter? So again, that, that's going to, you know, determine uh, ROI as well because you may be terrible on the phone with great at sales, so you need to use an appointment setter. Or you may have had trouble finding a decent appointment setter and you're better on the phone at setting appointments. So the name of the game is to get in front of as many people as possible to close business. And you have to kind of figure that out for yourself, what works in your area. Um, you know, are people more receptive to door knocking? Are they more receptive for a telephone call to book an appointment? Uh, also, it, personal choice. Maybe you don't like door knocking and you just want to set an appointment. So all these variables, you know, come into play when you're talking about uh, closing ratios for you know, avatar leads or any lead, really. And again, it can be different for, you know, for everyone. What What is your skill set? Uh, what's your tenacity level? And, you know, being professional, these all come into play with any lead, um, not just an avatar lead. So um, I may be preaching to the choir a little bit here, but I'm just trying to help help out some people. What you need to be concerned more about than the number of leads you close off of Avatar lead order. <clears throat> Excuse me. 
You just need to be concerned about return on investment. That's all that matters. Okay? It doesn't matter if you wrote 10 apps out of 25 leads. Uh, what matters is return on investment. So don't be so concerned on number of applications written. Concentrate on return on investment only. That's what matters. That's what everybody that's successful in a business looks at. So if you door knock only, make sure you're playing the recording of the lead and let your prospect hear their own voice. Very important. That's pretty daggum powerful as well to get in the door right then and close business. Uh, they responded. They had a conversation. They agreed to a callback. They want to talk to somebody about barrel life insurance. So there you are. You're in front of them. Take the steps to go in and close the business right then or book an appointment for the next day. Now, going over what a typical 25 lead avatar order should result in, I would say that it's going to result in at least three to five applications written, okay, or roughly 1500 to 2500 in in an annual premium. If you're doing less than that, I'd recommend some final expense presentation sales training because at that point, if you're getting in front of enough people, it's not the lead. Uh, it's it's you. <laughs> so I'm going to shoot straight with you. Uh, if you're having trouble writing at least three to five applications or $1,500 to $2,500 off of a 25 lead avatar order, you need some, uh, maybe a little bit of hand holding uh, to increase uh, your sales ratio. And uh, maybe you need a better uh, presentation. A good presentation will take care of itself uh, and the numbers will work out well. As long as you have a good presentation, these numbers seem to hold true. And I invite you all to make sure to get our new report. It's free. Uh, all you have to do is visit theleadjerk.com and fill out the contact form uh, for a copy of this free and valuable report. It's the top five ways to be successful with final expense telemarketing leads, a step-by-step -step guide on how to sell more final expense insurance using telemarketing leads. And that's by yours truly, Matthew Lowry, The Lead Jerk. So go to the site, um, opt in on the contact form, and this will be sent out to you immediately. Uh, no waiting. I think it's set up on auto mail. So as soon as you hit submit, it'll be sent out to you. Again, top five ways to be successful with final expense telemarketing leads. Head over there right now and grab your copy. As always, I appreciate you guys uh, taking the time to watch this. Uh, feel free to visit the site, theleadjerk.com. We've got numerous lead options. Uh, again, fill out the contact form. You're going to receive some special emails on lead specials and discounts that are not advertised to the public. So whenever we have a discount sale, if you're on that list, you're getting exclusive emails that nobody else is going to get. Um, feel free to watch all the video training. There are a lot of audio interviews, like I mentioned before, from top agents all across the country. It's going to be some of the best training you're going to get for free and with no obligation. If you order leads from us, great. I appreciate it. If you don't, go to the site anyway. Take a listen to the um, videos. You're going to get some good nuggets out of these videos. They're really, really good. I uh, wish these were around when I got started, but they weren't. So now they are. Take advantage of it. Um, reach out to us by email or phone. Um, my phone number, 770-354-5100. Secondary phone, 404-580-7151. Feel free to call either one of those. My email is matt at theleadjerk.com. Feel free to order anytime. Um, on the front page of the website, there's all kinds of information and videos you can watch. There's a video overview that explains exactly how to navigate the site and make it work for you. And we'll be more than happy to help by working to check the data in your area before you order. We don't take a single dime until we know we can get you leads in a uh, decent amount of time okay and we do have custom lead orders available so go and take a look and check that out as always guys i appreciate it matt lowry the lead jerk talk to you guys later bye bye